Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions Crystal Opening. So, I wasn't going to open up these crystals just yet, but as you can see, there's a level up event, and I wanted to open up these crystals just in case I broke my dupe streak and got a new champion. That would be the perfect time while a level up event is going on, otherwise I'll just level up someone else but first we are going to open up some of the lesser crystals now I have a featured five star as you can see there and I have two five star basics that I can open up but I want to try and get enough for a third uh, basic so let's pop some of these uh, five stars, I mean four stars. Now I have all of the four stars, so these are always gonna be dupes, which means I'm gonna get five star uh, hero shards. All right, just look at that. And we just awakened our uh, Vision Arcus. And I think we got, yep, we got a few uh, max signature ability crystals as well. And that usually gets you five star shards. So four stars are still worth it to me because they're pretty much five star shards. All right, let's go ahead over to the uh, max signature ability crystal. So we got a few of those. We're going to open up that legendary one as well. All right, let's see. Yeah, we're not going to worry about the Shattered Heart ones. Okay, that's for the two-star. I must have passed it. Uh, I wish they would just put them all together. Why did they separate them like that? I don't know. Make us take longer. That's what it is. All right, here we go. These right here should yield mostly five star shards there you go boom and just like that we have enough for three basic champions one featured we've got the legendary as well and uh we're gonna stop there i may open those up later for another opening but first let's go ahead and open up some of these uh, some guys asked me if I was going to open these up uh, in a video so I'm going to do that normally I don't uh, I don't think too many people really want to see it but uh, at least it'll give you an idea of the loot that we get for doing map 7 all right we're just going to pop them and let's see all right so I formed a mutant Got some T5 basic uh, catalyst fragments, which I don't always get. So that's actually pretty good. All right, got some more T4 basic. And we also got a fully formed uh, science. So all in all, not bad. All right, and I also have some map six that we're going to go ahead and open up. And then we're going to open up that legendary since we're right here uh, on that screen. Uh, let's see, where are you? There you go. And we're just going to pop them open. All right, got another catalyst formed. And we got a T2 alpha. All right. That's going to help us out, ranking our champions up. And let's pop the other. We got another catalyst form that I saw in there. Yep, and we got a T4 basic. Perfect, since we need those to rank up our champions. All right, now let's go ahead and open up this legendary crystal. And I've actually had pretty good luck, so I'm due for some bad luck out of this crystal. All right, let's spin this out. So in this crystal, you have a chance for a four star 
and a smaller chance to get a five star. I believe it's an 80% chance for a four star and a 20% chance for a five star. I've opened up two of these and I've gotten five stars both times. So I'm due for a four star, but if I can get a five star, awesome. And both of the five stars were first time awakenings. All right. I'm seeing nothing but four stars coming around here. Oh, if it had stopped on that She-Hulk, it would have been over with. That would have been a new five star champion. But I think they're dedicated not to give me new five stars, but we'll see. We've still got some time. Uh, we are going to go on over here and we're going to first get these Grandmaster crystals out of the way. We got two of these. And we'll spin these out, uh, but not for very long. Tap that. And we can get a five star out of this. See, if it had stopped there, it would have been awesome. But I have gotten mostly three stars. I call these my three star crystals. Uh, but I have gotten a four star out of these. Um, so let's see. Can we get a five star? Wouldn't that be awesome? Look at him teasing me with all those five stars, but we did get a four star. And remember I said four stars are basically five star shards for me. All right, and see he's max. So I get that max signature ability crystal and that's most likely gonna give me more five star shards. So a great source of five star shards once you have all of the four stars or even most of the four stars well worth uh opening up all right so let's go ahead and start spinning out these uh crystals here let's go ahead i don't want to accidentally uh get one of the featured all right and we're just doing the little pet method no it's just for fun for people that kind of get offended by the pet method or find it annoying. Uh, we're going to open up my dupe counter. And I'm also going to pop open the champions that I want the most. All right. So while this is spinning out, you can see that I'm up to 21 dupes in a row. No new champions. All right. Uh, Omega Red. Uh, we've got Namor. We've got Nick Fury, Human Torch. Aegon, Doom, who just got in the basic crystals, uh, Captain Marvel movie, and Warlock. Those are my most wanted. And at the bottom left, we've got Void. He's the one that I want awakened the most. All right. And the four up top, we call those the four horsemen because I need those for the Abyss. I'm not going into the Abyss without Aegon. And I would love all four of those, ideally, to reduce my resource usage in the abyss all right it's slowing down what do we got we got anybody new yeah he slipped over but actually all three of those i already have so we're just increasing the dupe counter not anything that i did not expect all right so let's go ahead we got some more six star shards uh we we just can't break that dupe streak just yet but we're hoping we're hoping that we will break this dupe streak all right let's go uh back in there and go back out and go back in and shake it all about uh and we'll just let that spin out so if i cannot get any one of my most wanted champions or a champion that i need for the abyss especially Aegon, then any new champion will do I won't mind any new champion because it expands my roster. Now, right now, I have even arena teams as five stars. So that's why I was kind of hesitant to open uh, these crystals. So I kind of have mixed feelings. I want a new champion, but I also love having even arena teams. All right, so we'll see. All right, it's gonna slow down on its own here. What do we got? Somebody new? If it could have gone one over, that would have been new. Uh, but still, dupes. But I am mad. Again, even arena teams. It sucks, but it is what it is. All right. 
let's keep going. We'll get uh, this last one for the basic anyway. Don't want to accidentally do anything crazy. There we go. And we're just going to go ahead and uh, spin that out. I saw Aegon up there in the front. Uh, I probably, at this point, because I'm looking to do Abyss eventually, I'm not in any rush, but I know I need Aegon. Uh, there's a dungeon crystal that has Aegon, and he's the only one in that crystal I don't have. So chances are I'm going to get a dupe if I open that crystal, but I got to do it. If I can get an Aegon here, then I won't open that crystal. Uh, I probably want Aegon at this point more than I want Doom. But Doom would be awesome because of the prestige. I have Awakening Gem ready for him and some Six Stones. All right, slowing down. What do we got? What do we got? Yep, yep, yep. Any of those. All of them are dupes. No new champion in that reel whatsoever. All right, so still have even arena teams. So that's the positive there. And we've got more six-star shards. All right, now for the final, final one for the video. Let's go out. Let's go back in. Let's go out and go back in. And I'm going to take away the most wanted because let's take a look here. Uh, the featured does not have all of the champions. So my most wanted uh, list does not apply. So in this crystal, we have these champions. Now, out of this crystal, Mr. Fantastic, Hulk, Dr. Doom, Man-Thing, uh, let's see, Venom the Duck, Guillotine 2099, although I have her as a six star, uh, only six of these would be new champions. Any of the others I already have, all right? Let's spin it out. Obviously the big boy prize from this would be Doom. But if I got any one of those six that I mentioned, it would at least be a new champion. Uh, so let's see. Now this particular crystal, I don't go for featured crystals except for one crystal and that's the one you get from the sigil because this crystal only costs 11,000 five star shards. The regular uh, featured costs 15,000. I'm not spending that much for a featured because generally I get nothing but old champions. All right, let's see. What do we got out of our featured? Okay, I'm good with that. That's a new champion. Finally, we've broken our streak. I am very good with that. I actually did want Venom the Duck. And get this, folks. Venom the Duck is a cosmic. All right. And what do we have here? We have a cosmic advancement. We're almost done with it after opening up all those crystals, but that is perfect. So yes, I broke my uh, dupe streak. I no longer have arena teams even, but I have a Venom the Duck, who is pretty cool. All right, so all in all, a pretty good opening because I did get a new champion out of it and I did finally break the dupe curse with a Venom the Duck. And this is why I opened up these crystals now for just this type of thing. I got a new champion and he's cosmic and there's a cosmic advancement going on and a level up. Perfect. All right. So that's going to do it. That salvaged the uh, video for me. Uh, I was already, you know, like, oh, more dupes, more dupes. But now I've got a new champion. So that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. And you all have a blessed day.